Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Well, we're going to get this other cage net put in this morning. And I want to feed them before we get them all shook up. Because after we get this net in, we need to um, fill it. And so they're going to be a little bit stressed. And then they won't eat. So I want to get them fed right now before we get this net in there. They're not, they're not acting real ambitious right at the moment. I put three scoops in there and they're just kind of like, eh. I think that's because Ron Mar is actually in the water. I've been wanting to get this other net, cage net, in there for over a week and just came to the conclusion that I'm going to have to have help to get it done. It just seems like my time is not my own anymore. Once we get this net stretched and in and the fish filled in it, then we've got to head directly out to the shrimp pond with our shovels and let the party begin out there. I'm not really hungry this morning. Many of you are asking why we cut down so much of the so many of the limbs around this pond. We were destroying all the shade. It's about nine o'clock in the morning. Uh, it's eight thirty-five, so you can see how much shade is in this, and it'll that shade will slowly recede until about noontime when there's no shade. But then, two o'clock in the afternoon, the shade begins on this side because there's this big canopy of trees here to shade it with the morning sun and all these trees here shade it in the afternoon sun so there's still a lot of shade on this pond yeah they're not hungry Tatai so yeah go ahead very arctic fish this morning maybe until well feeding today yeah but I usually feed them in the morning and feed them in the evening and they're hungry. They're not hungry this morning. Is there a dead one? A big one? Oh, the top guy is always playing. <laughs> It 
it's going to be a big relief off my mind to get this net in there. I don't want to feed them too much so that they're not hungry at all and so that when we throw out some bait feed to catch them that they don't respond so I'm just going to hold off here. Saka aja tumar. Penuhan sama enggak mar, ni enggak mai. Stop it. It's a coconut twinkie. Asa. Twinkie thinks that's a really shady coconut in the water right there, and so does swimmer. <laughs> swimmer. 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 That's a coconut. <laughs> Swimmer. That's a coconut. <laughs> Swimmer, that's a coconut, you stupid dog. <laughs> All right, uh, that's in place, and now it's putting rocks in it to weight the net down so that it's on the bottom. Did you put one here, Tate? Looking a little better every minute. Maybe they go to put one pole in the Huh? They put one pole in the Uh, we could, but that's about, that's about correct right there, Tata. It's, it's similar to the other one. What? There's a net. There's a net, the small net, like what, the one, the, the one you got. 
right now. A black cast net? A white one. A white one? Yeah. No, I have no idea. No. This, so remember, I don't know how long ago you get you get that kind of net for the supposed to be for the garden. For the what do you call that? For the shade? Uh oh. Yeah. You have, I think you have that in, in in the shop. I have no idea, like maybe. That that side right there is okay, Tatai, but yeah, maybe this one bring it up oh. like two inches maybe. The fish is trying to feed you, huh, Tatai? <laughs> All right, well, Tata and Rainiel are moving right along, getting the screen up. I haven't been able to help at all this morning because I first I had to go get the the feed garden net itself and then I just got back from taking Marcel and Gina over to visit Sandy and now as soon as they get this and, and, they, and they haven't sewn it on yet but as soon as they get it like I don't know what would you call pre-hung they're holding it in place with uh, palm fronds as soon as they get that done then we've all got to go out to the shrimp pond because it's about 11.30 and that high tide is going to be at 2. So we need to get there a little bit beforehand and uh, start shoveling in anticipation.